Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to temporarily disable a vast free antivirus on your Windows computer. So if you want to disable it for a brief period of time, this tutorial will be for you. And it's very straightforward. All you have to do is if we want to close out of our vast free antivirus window, you want to head down to the system tray in the bottom right corner of our screen. And there should be a little either an Avast icon listed here, or if you click on this little up arrow, you want to left click on it, there should be an icon that looks like Avast, and when you hover over it, it should say Avast Free Antivirus. You are protected. You want to right click on it, and then you want to left click on Avast Shield Control. You have options now to disable for 10 minutes, one hour until the computer is restarted, or disable permanently. So you have a few different options here. One of them should definitely fit into what you're trying to do. Let's say we disable it for 10 minutes. It might say an attempt has been made to turn off a key, a vast module. This may be a legitimate action, but can also be the result of a malware attack. Do you want to continue? Now you do have a time limit here to accept yes. So we're going to select yes, because this is a user initiated action. We'll take a moment to disable the shield, so just be patient. So once you've disabled the shields and you want to re-enable it, all you have to do is go back to this upward facing arrow, right click on the Avast logo, go back and left click on Avast Shields Control, and then left click on Enable All Shields, it should say Forward Disabled, left click on that to enable the shields. And if we go back to the tray, we can see the Avast icon now says you are protected again. And if we open up the Avast Free Antivirus User Interface, it should have similar results. So I hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.